what's going on guys so we're uh, we are making another lot of video for the meta guns now as you all know FR Avancer was the new gun in season 5 and at first I didn't like the gun because it had too much recoil uh, and by like I mean in warzone multiplayer is cool I, I, I don't care multiplayer you go there shipment man boom pop the double XP token level up the gun back to warzone at least that, that, that's what I do I don't know how people unlock all the camos unlock all the guns and unlock all the attachments and then can still play multiplayer I, I don't know that blows my mind away anyway so Avancer came with the uh, season 5 and I tried it out in Warzone at first you know you put the uh, the cliche uh, attachments the suppressor that gives you the most damage range and you know the barrel that gives you the most damage range or recoil so you got uh, the Harbinger D20 is the one that goes on the scar uh, sorry Tac 56 and you know all the other guns but man this shit ain't working so you've got to experiment with attachments and again sock sock and tread is the one that increases the more recoil because this gun is firing rate is insane man it's so and the re recoil will be insane the faster it fires so you got to go with the sock and tread uh and it says that it keeps your muzzle on target for fall off shots well that's what we want in warzone so you gotta tune it towards recoil stabilization, recoil control, and of course you gotta go with the 16 round ma magazine. And the barrel now, there were two choices. Now this barrel increases the recoil control more. Now the only reason it's going red in the recoil because it's hip fire recoil control. We don't ever shoot at SR rifle in hip fire, especially in war zone. So, uh, yeah, this one uh, did this barrel uh, now it increases hip fire accuracy again we don't care about that we only care about the damage range and the bullet velocity because this is a long range gun you've got to use it with another smg for close range which is up to you you know well 46 a lot of luckman sub the shotgun whatever so this is the barrel for it i've tried this one man the recoil control don't even matter and it's uh i i, I think the green bar should be cut in half because the half should be goes to uh hip fire recoil control no one cares about hip fire or AR. So you gotta go with the 600 mm FR long bore. Bro, who comes up with these names for the barrels? Anyway, tune it towards recoil uh, steadiness and damage range, and you got the 6 round mag. Now, I've seen there's a YouTuber called a uh, shout out to Marty Show from United States. Uh, he's a good YouTuber, man. He's he keeps it real about Call of Duty, you know, all the SBMM and all this, like, uh, the skill-based matchmaking and the hit, uh, skill-based hit registration. He made, made a bunch of videos about that. And, you know, it's been happening. Not as much, but, yeah, it happens. That uh, if you win too many games, that is going to match you up with players that are way, way better than you, man. So, that's what... So, I was watching his uh, stream, and uh, he had the advancer lot of him was killing pretty quick I was like whoa what is this so he had uh, I was I just watched his uh, clips and he has the uh, lot out there so instead of the rear grip and the under barrel he had the kuma or comb whatever the word is sorry English ain't my first language so I'm doing whatever I can so it gives you recoil steadiness and aiming stability I don't care about aiming stability but recoil steadiness <coughs> So you gotta tune it towards recoil stabilization and aim down the side speed. You don't need no aiming idle stability because the side is a, a slamline pro. So these are the five attachments that you gotta put on this and this is a pretty good gun, man. You obviously have to control the recoil of this. I don't know about console players, but what I do with my mouse is, is just I drag the mouse down to compensate for the recoil and it's a laser beam, man. So yeah, and this gun is from the bundle Dark Resource 3. You don't need to get the bundle at all. This is just uh, uh, cosmetic shit that I like. You know, this animated shit. This, it looks cool on the eyes, I guess. And you don't need no ammo or any, anything. That's all bullshit. So check this load out, man. It's a new gun. Pretty good. I uh, love it. I mean, shipment 24-7. And then go to Warzone and try it out. And uh, I think I've done all the tunings. Yep. So check this out, let me know in the comments how it goes. Peace!